Unemployment in California reached 12.4% last year, fifth highest rate in the nation. San Bernardino County's latest unemployment figures show a staggering 14.8% rate. But a bright new light looms on the horizon. Labor leaders say a new solar energy facility at Ivanpah is already adding jobs, enriching lives, and rescuing the local economy. Today's High Desert Region Economic Update focuses on local labor unions and their reaction to Bright Source's Energy Ivanpah Solar Project near the California-Nevada border. We're real proud of our partnership with Bright Source Energy and, and Bechtel Corporation and the building trades. What this means is, is, is jobs in this, in this economy. The craft workers will get back to work. It'll open up training opportunities for new people in the region to go into the apprenticeship programs. And it's really the stimulus in the green economy. These are true green jobs for renewable, for the, for the entire renewable industry that'll be translated over and over with other projects. So this really is a boon for this local economy and provides, provides a career path, good paying jobs. I mean, jobs that where people can buy houses and send their kids to school, a college education. It means a lot to this high desert area. I'm proud to say our local union, our, our international union, Labor's International Union of North America, we've been pioneers in the environmental uh, movement. I, I myself had a hazardous waste certification. I worked for Bechtel back uh, in the 90s. I'm excited for this, this uh, opportunity for the men and women of Layuna to pursue this career path. I'm, I'm very excited and, and it's going to hold promising careers for our people in the, down into the future. Solar is going to pave the way as one of the eminent sources of energy in the nation. It's very important we get this project off and running. For us, especially with the laborers and, and the laborers training school, I mean, we're all excited. I mean, for the whole green wave to hit us. It'll definitely help the local economy because it'll put people to work and uh, that's where it's, everybody's hurting right now. Bright Source Energy CEO and President John Woolard says the Ivanpah project will create over a thousand jobs during construction, plus another 86 permanent jobs but the benefits extend far beyond that. When community leaders look at a project like ours, uh, we've noticed that they're really focused on the long-term value that a project can bring to the community, which I think is very important. Uh, they're construction jobs over a several year cycle, but then we have uh, long-term employees that will be there for the decades that these plants will be in operation. Uh, our employees' children will be going to the school, so we're already integrating in with the fabric of that community. How far can the benefits of Bright Source Energy's Ivanpah Solar Project actually reach? Union members are very optimistic. As the country moves toward more and more green technology, the Bright Source Ivanpah Project provides an opportunity to increase the skills of the construction crafts and be able to translate those skills over and over on future projects. As far as I'm concerned, Bright Source has done a good deal because it's going to help. It's going to help San Bernardino County itself. It means that it's going to be a lot of work for up here in the high desert. Housing, you know, even in the construction field, there's going to be energy sources that we're going to need to learn about. And the more we learn, the better off we are. This project is going to help our community. It's going to put a lot of people to work. It's a, it's a good wage, uh, plus the benefits. They have insurance, retirement packages. Um, they're, you know, the community is actually going to be able to, to have a, a decent way of living. Get California out of the recession. Wouldn't that be something? Always good to hear some positive news. And that's it for this edition of the High Desert Region Economic Update.